Welcome to our next video. Uh, today I'm going to make a sandpaper organizer for your hook and loop uh, round paper uh, type. All I did was take a piece of uh, like a 1x6 wood pine I had left over and I've already made it to where everything's even. I laid it all out already. Just centered everything up and made my spots for the uh, for some holes. And today we're going to use 5 16 dowel rod. Um, and it's going to be at a slight angle just so they don't fall off of there. If you get too many on there they might fall off. So we're going to uh, put five of these in and they're all four inches long and then you'll just need a 5 16 drill bit to drill down through um, after that we'll sand this get our marks off uh, maybe put some uh, polyurethane coating on it'll keep uh, sawdust and so forth from hanging on the wood and next we'll uh, get this set up on the drill press uh, drill these five holes out and glue the dowels in and uh, should be pretty set after that hang tight okay now we're back we got our board with all our marks on for our holes we're gonna we got our drill press here I'll show you real quick that uh, we got the uh, way back in here. I have it set about five degrees, so that gives us our angle. So when we put the dowel rod in, it'll be at an angle. So now we're just going to drill our holes out. It's set up here. And we got our holes drilled out, so now we'll set it on the bench and we'll put our dowel rods in. Okay, we're just gonna put a little glue on in our hole here, just a little bit. Tap them right into place. Just like that. 
like so. Okay, so now we're just going to let that sit up, uh, let the glue dry, and then when we come back, we'll sand it down, get, get our pencil marks off, and put some Varathane uh, finish on the top, just a clear coat, and that should do it. Be right back. Okay, now we're back. We're going to sand down our piece of wood. Get our pencil marks off and then we're going to put a coat of two of uh, polyurethane coating on give it a nice uh, smooth finish so nothing nothing sticks to it Okay, now we're just going to wipe her off. Okay, I'm back here. We're gonna I just took a wet paper towel here to get all of our dust off. And you can use a tack cloth, I just don't have any left. Wipe this down here, get the dust off. Alright, I 
that's all dried off. polyurethane I get this uh, ferrothane polyurethane and it's uh, cleans up with water it's super nice so we'll put a coat of two of this on and then we'll sand it in between with some 220 We'll wait for that to dry and we'll be done so the next picture you'll see is with it all done and sandpaper sheets hanging off of it I made it this way and just figured well the sandpaper has holes in it what would be the easiest sandpaper organizer to make with its round shape and it already has holes in the sandpaper so we'll just hang it from one of them holes alright and we'll be back Okay, here we are. So we just put a couple coats of uh, clear polyurethane. As you can see, the sheen, nice and smooth. And if you look, you can see a slight angle on the dowels. And that's so we can hang our paper on. So this holder that I made holds five different types of paper, uh, usually 60, 80, 220, 320, and maybe the last one you might use something a little more than that, or you could use this last peg to put those uh, pieces of paper that you're just not ready to throw away yet. Uh, hope you liked my idea, and please click subscribe. Click the bell so you can see more of my videos. Thanks again. Thanks for watching American Woodsmith.